What is up as a figure hunter and I'm gonna give you a short video for upcoming reviews that are coming up this weekend because I'm not doing anything for the July 4th weekend which is maybe a bummer but giving me time to focus on some catch-up reviews for a few different products that are maybe off off the beaten path a little bit from what I normally do so I'm super fired up to get these reviews done and out the first is the airwave mouthpieces so they have the endurance and the high intensity version these are actually becoming more and more popular because it's based on science but it's also become more popular because some of the primary CrossFit Games athletes are wearing and using them. You can see Rich Froning, Katie, Katie Aramo, uh, Daniel Brandon all use the Airwave mouthpiece. So I'm going to share about my experiences using both the Endurance version as well as the High Intensity version. Next up is going to be a review for the Aura Strap 2. Now this is a biometric scanner that goes on a special strap for your Apple Watch and it actually reads your body mass index and your fat content and your muscle mass and all those things and it gives you sort of a readout and you can see progress over time so we're going to look at that. Next up is the Mantra Sleep Mask and it is actually pretty cool and again this is maybe way off the beaten path. This is the Sleep Mask Pro and they want me to do some specialty sort of review content for them but I'm gonna just do a simple review because I think it is awesome and it's something totally unique that I have found super effective and then last and most importantly the final and full review for the Garmin uh, 4Runner 255. Now this is a big deal because this is a watch that I'm gonna have a lot to say about because it is an actually awesome watch, especially for the CrossFit high intensity interval training community or the, the non running, biking, swimming videos that are out there and it works great for that community as well. So with that, that's the list of upcoming reviews throughout the July 4th weekend. So I hope you like them um, and stay tuned for more.